but I just want to uh, again uh, update everybody what's going on here in Kanoa. Uh, we've been working with uh, our a &E firm. We've been working really hard with uh, Warren Villagomez, who's our chair of the task force. We're here in Kanoa with HBR. Uh, and we just got an update with the, the A&E, as well as uh, have a female partner here at DOD. Uh, we'll be constructing the alternate uh, care site here in Kanoa, and the construction uh, will be commence tomorrow morning. Um, we're hoping uh, to get this done within three to four weeks. I know that time is of the essence. Um, again, we only have 11 positive today, but uh, working with Esther Munya with our CEO, uh, the task force, our medical professions, uh, we are um, making sure that we do everything we can to have our facility up and running. And I hope we never get to use it, uh, but if we do need it uh, in a month, uh, we'll have this up and running. So again, there's a lot of challenges, but um, we're moving forward and I want to thank the company, the construction company, everybody that's part uh, in this um, renovation and remodeling of uh, Kanoa and making this an official uh, site for our COVID-19. Thank you. Good afternoon, everyone. Um, we're here today, as what the governor had stated. Uh, we are here sharing all the information that uh, we are doing for Kanoa uh, Resort, uh, transforming it into a, a COVID uh, a medical care site. And we're excited with all the work that's been done by uh, Helios and Guma Engineering. Um, efforts are in place, uh, transformation is uh, ongoing and actively uh, uh, being done. So, um, you know, there's a multiple um, aspects of projects that the governor and lieutenant governor has outlined for us to take on. And, uh, you know, so far uh, with the partners of uh, FEMA, HHS, CDC, um, and of course central government, we're able to uh, facilitate all the efforts and coordination uh, with, with, with really uh, deep um, appreciation of CACC, uh, the medical staff, Dr. Tadella, CEO Munya, and the leadership to uh, keep CNMI, um, you know, at the level uh, in regards to um, making sure that our epi curve and uh, epi surveillance are actively engaged uh, to our community and determine, um, continue to determine the risk uh, of COVID-19 for our island cinema and we will be uh, we will be uh, providing um, weekly updates uh, the governor uh, and myself and uh, of course uh, C C uh, CEO um, on updates that uh, the community deserves uh, to better prepare and uh, better uh, uh, safe uh, guard uh, everyone in the cinema thank you